The truth about salt and microplastic contamination. A liter of seawater contains 35 grams of salt. About 3.5% of seawater is salt. Sea salt is mostly sodium chloride, but contains up to 75 other trace elements and minerals. Commercial sea salt is made by natural evaporation of seawater in dammed concentration ponds all over the world. As the water evaporates, the salt crystallizes into 99.7% purity. It is truly a wonder to see. Solar diked condenser ponds slowly bring up the salt concentration and remove other minerals. Traditional production in Vietnam The process can take up to two years to complete. Modern production in the industrialized world. Once harvested, it is cleaned, crushed, and dried. The outcome is pure sodium chloride, an essential ingredient of our diet. Unfortunately, microplastic contamination of pieces smaller than 5 millimeters in length are finding their way into our salt supplies and into our bodies. Plastic waste does not decompose easily. It just breaks up into smaller particles, eventually forming microplastic. It's a global problem. Plastic is even being found in the Arctic sea ice, reaching the northern latitudes in ocean currents. Common contaminants are plastic threads from the fishing industry along with packaging products, health products, and synthetic textiles. Let's take a closer look. In my study for this video, a 35 gram sample of sea salt yielded several pieces of plastic when photographed under a microscope. 35 grams is equivalent to only one liter of seawater. Red plastic thread was the most common. Salt from the Mediterranean had up to four to eight pieces per sample. That is a lot of plastic in a little over an ounce of sea salt. Black threads were also found. A blue piece of plastic, invisible to the naked eye, but revealed at a hundred times magnification. Pacific salt was less contaminated, but the plastic fingerprint was still present at one to two particles per sample. Possible microplastic at 200 times magnification. The amount of microplastic in our salt varies as to the contamination level of the ocean water used to make it. In fact, salt could be used to measure the degree of local ocean contamination. The message in the bottle is a warning to help keep the oceans clean. Microplastic is entering the Earth's food chains of filter feeding animals, fish, birds, and now humans. Education, removal, recycling, and alternative biodegradable materials are part of the solution. 
Even the use of bacterial enzymes to digest plastic could be used. Keeping our food supply safe is a concern for all of us since the effects of plastic in our bodies is unknown. Through awareness, all challenges can be overcome. Joining the conversation is the beginning of the solution. Thanks for watching Archie World Films and please subscribe to our channel.